the land of Calradia as we watch the great wandering swordsman Bill adventuring across the land in search of fame, fortune, and glory. Hello guys, me again here, back with the next episode of my... T uh, why did I say <laughs> I'm so used to saying Tech It series. Anyway, uh, I'm back here with uh, Mountain Blade Warband. Last time we went on a epic quest looking for a strange set of foreign armor, which appears to look very similar to our uh, samurai armor. And um, we went and found the two pieces of it, or two of the three pieces, in uh, Tia and Rivercheg. And we are going back to... <laughs> where the hell am I? We're going back to um, find the third piece in Jelkala, hopefully avoiding confrontations with bandits and whatnot in the uh, process. So we do have to go fairly far. Oh, burp, sorry. <laughs> Alright, uh, so, a couple of things. One, I no longer have headaches, so I can talk normally! Yay! So I can, I can do more voice narrating with a little bit more precision. Apparently listening back to my voice, it doesn't actually sound that bad, to be honest. Oh, I just have a feeling that my uh, voice acting kind of sucks. I mean, I can do the I can do the deep narrator voice and dramatic. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Dramatic explanations of what's going on, uh, with also some slight funny thing. But I can't do individual voices all that well. Two people are just going to sound very similar, or they're going to sound like absolute retards. But hey, what the hell? It's funny, isn't it? It's funny, isn't it? So I'm going to head. Over here. Bandits following... Oh, they were following me. They're not anymore. Uh, while we're still, um, travelling, uh, I'd like to apologise for the, uh... Oh, another non-aggression treaty. I'd like to apologise for the non-aggression treaty! Um... <laughs> no. Uh, I'd like to apologise for the wildly varying times of my, uh of my videos. Some of them are 5, like 15 minutes, some of them are 20 minutes. It depends entirely on what I do. Sometimes it's just a good idea to stop it. Other times, external things make me uh, need to stop. Like someone will drive up in the driveway and I can't constantly record when they're there. So, uh, you know, it, it depends. So just keep that in mind in future videos. Uh, it might be a little time till Jail Carla. So let's let's sing a song. Hmm, what should we sing? What should we sing? We all live in a yellow submarine. No, 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 no that's that's not good. I didn't even know the lyrics to that. About, I'm never gonna give you up. I'm never gonna let you down. I'm never gonna run around and desert you. I'm never gonna make you cry. I'm never gonna say goodbye. Never gonna tell a lie and hurt you. That was better. That was nice. Oh yes, we're almost at Jokala. Singing Never Gonna Give You Up has always made time go fast for me. Alright, so as Bill the Swordsman arrived in Jokala, he decided to take a walk around the streets and search for the final piece of this legendary armor he was hunting down. He rode slowly onto, not so slowly, even trot, trotting pace. Bill, could you just keep a steady pace so I can accurately describe what you're doing? Okay. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Uh, he decided to look for the... Oh, crap. No, I've lost my chain of thought. Screw you, Bill! I'm sorry! I'm sorry, okay? There's no reason to yell at me, Mr. Narrator, man. No reason to yell at me, okay? I'm just doing my thing. I don't care what you're doing! You're interrupting my train of thought! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um... Well, that wasn't hard. Well, there you go. That's the final... Oh, Alright, uh... Let me, let me just do this a little bit more dramatically. Uh, can I... Can I walk? Excellent. Oh, yes, excellent. Uh, I face this way. Look at this. Bill had discovered his final leg of the... Oh, screw you, Bill! You're making me lose my train of thought! Screw you to hell! Oh, well, I'm sorry, Mr. Narrator Man. I'm just... I'm doing my thing too. I don't care what you're doing! Oh, whatever. Alright, uh, okay, so here we have uh, Strange Boots. Yay! Full set! Look at that armor! It's all good! And the strange sword, which appears to be a... Uh, wait, one-handed, two-handed? That's interesting. Um, That goes number one. Strange sword, sword I don't use as often, so... I'm just going to be a swordsman with a shield. So, yes, I've got everything. And, uh, Jess, if you're watching, and I know... Sorry. Jess, if you're watching, and I know you'll be watching this. Uh, Yes, 
I have found the final piece of armor. So there you go. So this is what it looks like. It's pretty cool, isn't it? It's like, got, look, three samurai swords. One long one, one short one. Uh, and full samurai armor. And the cool thing about samurai armor is it's, it's unique. Okay, so this is the, um... Which sword is this? This is like the full-on samurai sword. Oh, I see. So it's like, it is one-handed now. And it can be used with a shield. But when it isn't being used with a shield, it's two-handed. Oh, die. Okay, that didn't do much. Alright, so... The quest for the mysterious armor had been... Oh, sure, you want to do that again? Bro, stop interrupting me! Uh, <laughs> Alright, um... So, the quest for the mysterious armor... I, I swear to God, I will come down there and cut your head off if you interrupt me one more time. Okay, stop. The quest for the mysterious strange armor has been completed as Bill the Wandering Swordsman had completed the final leg of his journey and now needed to decide what he wanted to do. I need to decide what I want to do. YES, YOU NEED TO DECIDE WHAT YOU WANT TO DO! Okay. Alright, so, uh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? Um... I want to become rich and famous, so... Hmm, how do I become that? Well, I'm here in a town. I may as well go to the castle and, uh... Ooh, look at me. My snazzy armor, and my snazzy armor. Uh, I need to go and find some work, I suppose. Some quests to help keep me on track. And let's see what we've got here. Lady Isola of Suno. Uh, do I know you? My name is Bill, at your service. I am Masola, rightful queen of the Swadians. Group, don't even make fun of me for this. I thought Kingdom of Swadia was ruled by King Harless. I was the only child of my father, King Esterich. Although I am a woman, he loved me like a son and named me his heir. His heir. I can't speak, I can't pronounce things, because women aren't educated in these times. Not once, but several times, before his grandest nobles of the land... Sorry, before I can't speak properly, blah, 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 so that none could doubt his intention. There is no law that bars a woman from ruling. Indeed, we saw his Swadians tell tales of warrior queens who ruled us in our distant past. Yet when my father died, his cousin Harless convinced the nobles that no Swadian king of sound mind would name a woman as his heir. Harless said that his designation of me was the act of a madman, and thus had no legal standing, and that he, as my father's closest male relative, should have taken the throne. I will admit that I did cause no good by, causing, by cursing Harless and all who listened to him as traitors, and I believe that the magistrates who ruled in his favour were bought. No matter, I will raise an army of loyal subjects who would honour their old king's memory and will. And if anyone doubts that a woman can wield power, then I will prove them wrong by taking Harless's ill-gotten crown away from him. I want to take up your cause and help you reclaim your throne. Are you sure you'll be up to the task, Bill? Reclaiming my throne will be no simple matter. Lords of our realm have all sworn oaths of homage to King Harless. Such oaths to a usurper are, of course, invalid, and we can expect some of the lords to side with us, but it will be a very tough and challenging struggle. Unfortunately, King Harless's grip is fairly strong. Until we can shake it, we have to look forward to a... We have to look long and hard for allies. I am ready for the struggle. I have no doubt that your support for my cause is heartfelt, Bill, and I am grateful to you for it, but I don't think we have much of a chance of success. If you can gain renown in the battlefield and make a name for yourself as a great commander, then our friends would not hesitate to join our cause, and our enemies would be wary to take up arms against us. When that time comes, I will come with you gladly. But until that time, it would be wiser not to openly challenge the usurper, King Harless. Well, screw you then! Fine, I'm not helping you. I need to find another way of getting money. Hmm. So... I've not met the guildmaster yet. Alright. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a walk around the streets, look for the guildmaster, and I'm going to see if I can't get a job from him. Eh? Well, there he is, right there. Right. Hello, stranger. You seem to be new to Del Cala. I'm the guildmaster of the town. Uh, do you happen to have a job for me? One of the merchants here is looking for herdsmen to take his, bleh, his market to the thing at Cura. I read that quickly. The cattle herd must be within, at Cura within 50, 30 days. Sooner is better, much better. But it must be absolutely no later than 30 days. If you can do that, I'd be willing to pay you 532 dinars for your trouble. Interested? Um, I don't really like herding cows. I suck at it to start with. Um... Oh, well, this could prove amusing. <laughs> Aye, I can take the herd to cure all. Splendid! You can find the herd right outside town. After you take the animals to cure all, return back to me and I will give you your pay. Okay, leave. Alright, leave. Leave this place and never return. 
Okay, so here's gel color, and there's cure all, and I need to drive them all the way over that. You've got to be kidding me. You have, like, got to be kidding me. Alright, head for the bridge, cattle. Head for the bridge. Follow the cattle. No, 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 that way, that way. Bridge, 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 bridge. Go the bridge, go the bridge. Yeah, that's it. Oh, no, I'm not, I'm not, sorry. I, I didn't mean to talk to you. I'm trying to chase cattle. All right, that way, across the bridge. Yes, yes, follow that. Yes, cross the bridge. Yes, yes, that way, okay. That was just one thing. Now we have about 50 million places to go. That'll just be fun. If you stay straight, all right, so go behind them in a sweeping motion. Behind them in a sweeping motion. I have played Red Dead Redemption. I've had a herd cows. Cow herd simulator 3000. <laughs> that needs to be a game. Uh, there's like hospital tycoon, prison tycoon, roller coaster tycoon, cattle tycoon. Oh my god, that actually might be a good game. Like run a, a cattle station or something. At this point, I'm just like focusing on how to how to keep them straight. I'm actually focusing on where I'm going. All right, this way, this way. No, that way. This way. Why are you going the opposite direction I'm going? Oh my god, this is challenging. This could take a while. That way, that way! Okay, uh, weekly budget, uh, lost four dinars. I'm still quite set with money. Alright, so, um, let's get some direction. I'm still not even a tenth of the way there. Uh, and on top of everything, I've lost where I am. Oh, there I am. It's okay. So I'm just going to head them in that direction. So if I keep clicking in a sweeping motion, I should be good. Oh, Amanra is now playing C9. What the hell is C9? Amanra is my uh, friend. My friend Lucas, by the way. I've known him since, like, uh, primary school. He's a cool bloke. Very cool bloke. Very cool bloke. Okay, um... Ugh, oh, cattle herding is not my thing. How much time has elapsed? I think I've gone... It's gone for about 10 minutes or something. Not the actual, uh, cow herding. I just need to keep an eye of what the time is, so I don't go too long. I don't like having to split these things up into two episodes, because then you get, uh... Oh, just go straight, you stupid turds! Stupid cattle won't go. And... Hey, narrator man thingy, why aren't you commenting? Because I don't want to! Shut the fuck up, Bill! I'm sorry, don't need to yell at me! <laughs> just focus on hurting those fucking cows! Right, so we can say that you delivered them safely. Doesn't make good narrating if you didn't do it properly. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, that way, that way, you stupid cows! Why must you be pains in the asses? Ugh, surely it doesn't need to be this hard in real life. Eh. You guys are probably getting really bored, just like, OMG, he's herding cattle, big whoop. Ugh, it's very, very painful. Both physically and mentally. It makes me want to claw my brain out and tear my hair out with my bare hands. Dun 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 herdsman style. Dun dun, fuck, forest bandits. There's only three of them! That's five of me. Maybe I can get a little bit of a battle in quickly. What's okay, what's my speed? 3.7, nah. Uh, the time I catch up to them, these cattle will be off to god knows fucking where. Alright, uh, so where am I going? I'm going to Kuror, which means I need to head past here, along the river, to the right. Right, so I need to go to the right of that river. Right, got it. I'm well past halfway there, I think. So I'm getting there very freaking slowly, and I'm not doing this job again, I am not. No more herds after this. This is the last herd. Last herd ever. You know, I think I am going to name this cattle herd here. Baby Qual. Baby Qual. Baby Qual. 
Not koala, quarrel. Q U A R L. Don't don't Google that. You'll get a band or something. Just it's a it's an inside joke between me and my apparently wife Tara. Apparently we're married on Facebook. We have like a really random relationship. It's really funny. I'm just like randomly stating things as I'm trying to herd stupid cattle to where they need to go. Oh, right. Um. So I need to herd them that way. Right. Let's go. Turn, 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 you stupid cows! There we go. Oof, this is hard. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What's that? Fuck, 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 fuck. Desertus. Fuck, I can't handle 11 Vega footmen. I've only got 5 men. And on top of everything, it's night in a forest. Oh, how fun. How fucking wonderful. Shit, this dessert is like right there. Oh, fuck. Ah. Ah, leave me alone. Oh, fuck. Um... 45 dinars, I can handle that. Alright, uh, pay them off. So let me go. Alright, now piss off. Go away. I'm just not in the... A, the mood for a fight. The character's too busy herding sheep. Uh, not sheep, cows. These are sheep now! Sheep herd. Yes, sheep herd. Cattle sheep. Cattle sheep. <laughs> cattle sheep. Cattle squid. Cattle squid? Yes, there needs to be cattle squid. That is a, uh, a random joke. If Tara's watching this, she'll get it. Cattle squid. Cattle squid. <laughs> oh, alright. I have a feeling that, um, delivering this cattle herd will probably be the end of this episode. A boring episode, I know, but hey, an episode nonetheless. Ah, Boya Drooly's party. Drooly. Oh, uh, I just remembered, I need to change my character's name. Bill the Samurai. Because he is a samurai. Excellent. Bill the Samurai. Excellent. Right. So, come on. Cross the bridge. Another bridge. This will be fun. Ugh. These things have a fear of bridges. 92 ca cows. Cattle. Walking hamburgers with uh, fears of bridges. Yes! Yes! Excellent. You wonderful things. Come on. That's it. Oh. I did it. I successfully did it. Alright. It's, uh... While we're here, let's, um... Visit the tavern. Get a nice drink to calm down. What's, what's going on here? Tavern keeper. Um... Uh, have you heard of anyone in this realm who might have a job for a man like myself? Hmm, well, King Yaraglek is often looking for... Oh, well, King Yaraglek is often looking for mercenary... That's a male voice. I can't do female voices that don't sound terrible. Okay, a dude is looking for... Yo, man, a dude is looking for dudes to fight other dudes in his dude wars, right? Let me think some more, man. I've heard that some dude is over in dude place has been worried about dudes establishing dude hideout in his area. You might want to do with him, dude. Let me think some more. But to some other dude over in Dude Castle has been asking around for something who might want work. I'd watch yourself with him. He's a really creepy dude, though. Let me take some more. I've heard that some dude over in Dude has put Dude, 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 Dude. There's so many dudes here. I'm duding all over the place. Dude is. There may be other dudes work. There may be other work, dude. Of course, L dudes and other dudes who have other tasks who don't need Dude, Dude, Dude. dude. Uh, that sort of thing. <laughs> all right. Um. Yeah. There's people who want work. End of story. All right. So what have we got here? Ferentis. Oh, who's this guy? I am lost. Lost. Why so gloomy, friend? I have committed the greatest of sins, sir. And it is my shame that I must appoint you my confessor, if you should like to hear it. I was a captain of horse in the service of the Lord here in Curor, and my brother served with me, but we were both in love with the same woman, a courtesan, a temptress, who played upon our jealousies. My brother and I quarrelled. I had drunk too much. He slapped me with his glove, and I spit him upon my sword. My own brother! My sword arm was stained with the blood of my kin. Do you believe there is a hope 
for a man like me? Can I find the path of righteousness? Or am I doomed to follow the demons that dwell inside of me? You could join us, right wrongs, fight oppressors, redeem yourself, that kind of thing. Yes, you must have been sent by divine providence. Lead me, lead me away from darkness. I am well practiced in the arts of war, but I beg you, sir, I wish to use my skills to defend the innocent, the pure and the defenseless, not to be a common brigand and wreak more wizardry, wizardry than I have already wrought, wrought. I know that's misery. I'm having troubles with the W. Happy to be of service. Get your things together and we shall be on our way. Good. Give me a few moments to prepare and I'll be ready to move. All right. That's a... Uh, oh, got another guy. A party. Hit P. For Rentus. Oh, he has a... He has a percent bar. Oh, I have a hero. I have a hero, dude. Yes. I think these guys can't even die anyway. So I have some special dude. He's my special friend. Special... I'm not gay. That's just me being an idiot. The Shavi. Yes. Oh, that's a uh, male voice. Yes. Keep your distance, by the way. My apologies. I was merely going to say that you look a bit down on your luck. My luck? You could say that. It was my bad luck to be born to a weak father who married me off to a drunken layabout who beat me. It was my bad luck when I ran away from my husband to be taken by a group of bandits. It was my bad luck that the only one among them who was kind to me, was taught, who taught me to hunt and to fight, inspired the jealousy of the others who knifed him and forced me to run away again. But I do not count myself unlucky, stranger. No more than any other woman of Calradia, this fetid black water, this dung heap among the nations, populated by apes and jackals. Hmm. Are you by any chance looking for work? I might be. I could certainly use the money. But let your followers know that I do not suffer louts and brutes. Anyone who misbehaves around me will quickly find an arrow in their gullet. I will hire you. Try not to shoot anyone on your first day. Good. Give me a few moments to prepare and I'll be ready to move. Alright. Two heroes. I'll just move them up because I like having the heroes at the top. To Shavi. So I've got an archer and a swordsman. Woo! My warband is coming together well. Lesolet, who's this dude? Yes, what is it you wish? To pass the time of the day with a fellow traveller, if you permit. Very well, I do not mind. My name is Lazolet. It is an E there, bro. Well, it's cool. I'll, I'll take your word for it. I am the second son of the Count of Droa, whom you have no doubt heard. Having no inheritance of my own, I came here to seek my fortune in Calradia, training men in the art of battle. Unfortunately, the Lord here in Cura has no taste for the disciplinary methods needed to turn rabble into soldiers. I told him it was wiser to flog them now than bury them later. But he would not listen. I was told to take my services elsewhere. So, if you know of any commander who believes that his purpose is to win battles rather than pamper his soldiers, I'd be pleased if you directed me to him. I might be able to use you in my company. I'd be pleased to ride with you, at least for a little while, for pay and a share of any loot. I am a skilled swordsman, and I can also instruct your men in fighting, but I warn you, I do not care to fight for a leader who is lax in discipline with his men, for in the long run they will not respect a soft hand. Good, I'll be happy to hire someone like you. Ah, one last thing. I would ask for an initial bounty of 400 dinars before I join your command. It's my principle never to enter someone's service without receiving the payment I deserve. Sorry, can't afford that at the moment. Deal with it. So I have two new people. Excellent. Take a walk around the streets. Just be awesome. Oh, how pretty is this? The nice snowy town of Kuro. So I reckon that's I reckon that's probably a, a good place to wrap it up right there. This has been a very successful episode, I reckon. We have managed to get the samurai sword, and now we are one of the most unique soldiers in Calradia. We've managed to get two heroes, we've got some payment waiting for us over at Jelkala, so I reckon this has been pretty successful. So thank you guys for watching this episode, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and please take a moment to like and subscribe this video. Like and subscribe, sorry, like the video, subscribe to the channel, you know what I mean, so cool. So thank you guys for watching, thanks for uh, supporting Xavier Gaming, and I hope you guys have a good time. See ya! Bye! One second. Goodbye, puny mortals! I shall be here waiting for you when you return! <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. That doesn't even sound right. Goodbye!